You want to go ahead and tell everyone what they're watching, what they're hearing, what they're listening to? <clears throat> Me? Yeah. Welcome to the Safety Third <laughs> Podcast. I am that was the best Dr. <laughs> podcast I've ever had. Holy shit. <laughs> That's the energy we want to start with. Yes. Like, what are we doing? Oh. Why are we here? Let's go. Let's go. This is the episode of the Safety Third Podcast. To, uh, I, don't, I don't know where this it's going. This is Emily. We've got One Emily, of the, the engineer, ah. and Code Bullet. I'm still here. They couldn't kick me out. He's still <laughs> here. He has a better mask he, now. Yeah, <laughs> you're going to upgrade yes. his mask. I really wonder if they, does it sound actually go to the microphone because you're apparently it does we've got a yes from the producer that the sound is going to the microphone otherwise you're holding it where your mouth would be but your mouth you don't have a mouth oh, no, should i go yeah. under you know I, this no, or we no, that might be even more muffled if you do that it might evan, be yeah, evan came evan came to america with zero plan he's like i'm here for a month i don't know what i'm doing where i'm staying and you know what i respect that <laughs> I, I didn't book any accommodation i just rocked up went to will's <laughs> well, I didn't even get to Will's the first night because I didn't want to drive in LA traffic day one. That's fair. That's absolutely yeah. Yeah, like yes. frame one of no getting to one, America. No one wants to drive in there. After zero sleep, and I took sleeping pills on the plane to be like, oh, this will help me sleep. And then I ended up not sleeping. And so I had zero sleep and the sleeping pills. Audrey, the and dogs then I was like, drive on, on the wrong side of the road, motherfucker. Oh, the dogs are pushing oh! buttons. Oh, my God. Oh! What is happening right what now? What just Does happened? It look are like we good? Something? Are we still on? Does that change the cameras at all? There's... They're all off. The, the dogs, dogs killed. <laughs> no. Oh, the camera's off. Is there still audio? Is it okay? There's still audio. All right, we're back. Well, for guess what? For well, the guess people what? Who are only listening? Nothing has changed. You get the you. audio listener experience <laughs> right now. There are some dogs in here that have stepped on buttons that have turned all the cameras off. I guess. You know, this is yes. the first time we've done the podcast in my house, and I'm yeah. so glad we're all here right and now. And the last time. <laughs> and the last time. <laughs> Okay. Oh, let's go. Oh, we're back. Oh, no. We're back. Yeah, there wasn't a camera number four. <laughs> Doug is on my mic. I love oh. you, but but I need it. Oh, we got I a... need it. Oh, yeah. Just, I need it. I have a space it. on the couch. I'm hoping that one of them sits here, but so far they're just, they're, they're just stepping I've, on the equipment. I've, I've claimed yeah. him now. He's, he's <laughs> great chilling with me. This is great. Uh, yeah. This is probably a good time to also mention that uh, by the time this comes out, it's going to be open source pretty soon, right? If we're going like one, two, three, open four source. weeks, something like that. I don't know. Yeah, That's I so mean, fun. Uh, <laughs> let's pretend that open source is right around the corner. So uh, make sure you go to. It's open tomorrow. Source. What? It's tomorrow. What? Crazy. Tickets are running out, guys. <laughs> There's well, almost. No, it could be tomorrow. <laughs> There's five tickets left. You better buy them right now. Oh, open yeah, source yeah, yeah. dot live. Both of you guys are going to be there, right? We're all going to yeah. be there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you want to meet. Any of us come to open source. Wait, does that mean are you gonna have a mask or are you actually? I'll gonna... figure it out. I might have a mask. I might have a face. You have thing. to do a face Dude, reveal before yeah. open source. It's like four months or three months away. Oh, or, yeah, well, no, but, well, the people watching this, it could be tomorrow. Or <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Might be check away. check my channel out for a face reveal. <laughs> That'd be funny if I had a face reveal before this all comes out. So this is all for fucking nothing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Worth the effort, probably. It might not even be Code Bullet. You know, it could just be yeah, some person with a bowling mask Australian on. You never know. Found off the street. Yeah, yeah. We found just a sound alike. And then, are you, Emily? Are you gonna be bringing any uh, any costumes? Any? any <laughs> oh. particular, I don't want to say Iron. I don't want to assume Iron Man suit because yeah. I know that you're moving away from that. What are you gonna come bring out Iron if, Man? Suit? If people you if people demand it, I will I will bring it. But yeah, we'll we'll see. Maybe <laughs> I it's, I say maybe I'll have something cooler by then, but if I'm being realistic, I probably won't. So I feel like <laughs> Iron Man costume. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you can get cooler than an Iron Man. I'm just I'm just kidding. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you so, have peaked wait, in your career, you're trying, this is all. <laughs> you're trying to break away Welcome from Iron Man? I am. I I don't know. I don't want to be known as the Iron Man chick. Short form content, people love it. TikTok loves it, but like, do I like it quite as much as I used to? Oh, I don't that's know. classic. You yeah. know, yeah. none yeah, of us, none of us wanna... enjoy any of the things no, we do. Never. I hate oh, all okay. the Welcome people. to the club. <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting this on. I am dying on the inside right I'm now. Not... <laughs> no, these American motherfuckers. I, I like it, but I also don't want to wedge myself in a corner, content wise. Oh, yeah, like, yeah. Okay. When you do, like, if I don't pivot soon, then like. Well, it's going to be like 10 years later, Iron Man Mark yeah, 75. You, you, you can still <laughs> do whatever you want whenever you want. And then That's maybe true. it's yeah. like what you, you, you got the bills to pay, and so maybe then you do an Iron Man thing. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Like, Pop out another Iron Man. Yeah. Yeah. You know, that's, that's what I said with the uh, molten aluminum. I'm like, I don't want to be the molten aluminum guy anymore. And then I try something else. And I'm like, you know, maybe just once a month I'll pour aluminum on yeah. something. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but when's, when's, so you haven't done an aluminum video in like years and yeah, you're doing years. great. Yeah. 
So it's yeah. like so it's pivoting totally works. Pivoting you are, works you, are proof. you know what? Yeah. We can rotate or something. I can do Iron Man stuff. There you we can... go. We can switch off. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You'll be like, if you're looking for the molten aluminum videos, go over here. Yeah. <laughs> Stop coming over yeah, here. Like, they'll be everywhere. You'll, you'll look <laughs> <same> <laughs> <though>. <laughs> uh, at this point, I, I think you probably have the most experience out of all of us with like conventions and like like big gatherings. And we oh, honestly yeah. have we have no idea what we're doing with this open, open sauce. sauce maker fair uh, sort of event. I wouldn't say I have too much experience. I mean, I just started getting into this like within the past two years or yeah. so. Well, so I, we only got into this in about February. That is fair. That, that is yeah. also yeah. fair. <laughs> Whatever that was. Four months yeah. ago Whatever now. <laughs> Do you have any, what, what's a hot tip? For a hot can tip? You, can you yeah. help us? Uh, you help us? How about that? <laughs> also, would you, would you like to be the owner of Open Sauce? We'll sign oh, it over to you. Wow. You'll be fully okay. responsible for On whatever happens. On the spot. Interesting. I'm trying <laughs> to think of a tip. Um, let's Shower. see. AC is nice. There's a lot of have, people. No AC, no we AC. Actually no, don't oh, have AC. okay. <laughs> it's a giant warehouse, right? Like, that would be insane. Yeah. To well, it's, yeah. it's going to be in San Francisco, and San Francisco is a little chilly, right? Well, it'll be it's, it's in a, it's July. It's in a warehouse. Wait, when is it against? July. July, July. 14th. And, oh wait, 15th, 15th and 16th. Okay. Fuck, we should probably figure this out before, you yeah, know that. before you our open sauce that. happens. <laughs> we should figure this out before the event happens. <laughs> They told us it's going to be nice in San Francisco, okay. July, like okay. in July, okay. specifically 15th and 16th. Beautiful weather. Okay. All right. They yeah. can predict it this far out. That's yeah, that'll be all. Chat That's GPT good. told me. Chat GPT. <laughs> so climate control check. We were just counting on God for that one. God's yeah. got that one in the bag. God's yeah, yeah. got that one covered. <laughs> <He's> never, <laughs> we're kind of fucking it up a little bit. What's Sammy a Sosa do? More than he would have Something intended, like but... Sammy Sosa. Anyway, Sammy Sosa. Yeah, I did like the Sammy Sosa thing. <laughs> it's like, oh. What are you doing? Every time he hits a home run. No, he's thanking oh. God. He's oh. is he? I think. He yeah. <clears throat> is w he was a baseball man, right? Baseball boy. Yep. <laughs> baseball boy. <laughs> baseball bro. <laughs> baseball boy. Is there anything like in ter what's your favorite food to eat in an Iron Man suit? Like what is something, there finger food good or bad for that? I mean anything I can really reach up into the faceplate with. So like a churro would be nice because I, can, oh. <laughs> like I can... <laughs> something vaguely phallic. Just, just, <laughs> well that came across real under. <laughs> something, something you know long, all drinks grassy. need to have straws because I can't like reach my face. Right, right, right. right. Stuff like that. Yeah. Paper I mean, straws or plastic straws? How much do you like turtles? I hate Throw them right paper out the window straws. Into the yeah. I love the turtles, but plastic, I'm sorry. Plastic, plastic, plastic. <laughs> I'm sorry. When you go to Jamba Juice and someone gives you a paper straw for a smoothie, mm -hmm. I'm like, I would rather step on a pile full of Legos <laughs> than you know, yeah, a yeah. straw. I think death. So, I don't know. <clears throat> Well, Emily's canceled. Who's not yeah. yeah. uh, <laughs> uh, It was a matter of time. I love sea it's turtles. Fun. It was just sea turtle day. I also love killing sea turtles. Is that what <laughs> we're talking about? <laughs> That's kind of the conclusion we got to. I was like, yeah. uh oh. So straws, straws are important. Check straws. straws. Food is important. Yes. I think the more obnoxious, like weird things, the better. Like y'all were talking about, like a giant inflatable Among Us. Yeah, we I oh, think yeah. people would Big literally booty inflatable go. Among Us. I think people would literally just go and be like. Yeah, I'm gonna take a picture. It's in front like of the that. eighth like, wonder of the world. Yeah, yeah. it's like the yeah, uh, the like side that. of the road. It's like the world's biggest ball of twine, and then the world's yeah. biggest booty among us. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> twerking in the wind. Yes, I think Slapping. things like that are are crucial to okay. attracting people. No, I think that would be good. <laughs> among us, good because that that's us. that's yes. definitely <laughs> happening. Yes, good. We have it. By now, we definitely have it. By now. <laughs> I, oh God! Imagine like it's so nice being here in time mm -hmm. where we can make all of these promises and it's our yeah. future selves <laughs> problem yeah, to actually yeah, yeah. fulfill them. Yeah. And I can make promises and I don't have to do shit. Exactly. <laughs> so the there will someone... be Among Us with mad cheeks. Yes. By the time this podcast comes out, we will have big red inflatable Among Us. We'll have plastic straws. We'll have churros. Air conditioning. We'll have air conditioning. God's air yep. conditioning. Which Mark is Rober. The wind. The wind. Mark yeah. Rober's a lock. I'm pretty sure that we yes, got I, yeah, okay. I'm pretty sure we signed a blood contract with him and he has to show up. Yeah, I think there's old. a there's a Kiss Nile Red booth. Oh, oh yeah, now oh. that we've said it, oh. now that we've said yeah. it, it's yeah. gotta happen. Wait, he's not he's not actually coming. <laughs> Is he not coming? Oh, that's I right. He's yeah. actually not coming. He's too busy. No. It's alright. I will find him and I will kiss him. <laughs> you can't you can't just do that to people. You can't just walk up to people and kiss them. It's alright. I'm an honest. No. 
<laughs> no, I was about to say, like people that. won't know what his face yeah, looks like, right? Like like quickly, how... <laughs> in and out. He won't even know what hit him. Who was that? <laughs> I'll never know. <laughs> I am, I am a legitimately really looking forward to this though. I think that mm -hmm. I think like 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 it's probably gonna be good. And like even if it's not, look, listen, look, look, hear me out. Really okay, hear me out. Okay. It even will be good. if this event like is the fire festival of maker fairs literally catches on fire if that's the bottom i think it's still going to be pretty good because i'm pretty sure plan b is we, we're just going to start handing out like handles of vodka and we're oh, just yeah. going to sing kumbaya over the fire yeah. with so, all our youtube all, friends with all six thousand people in mark rober yeah, yeah. <laughs> and all the kids and stuff too yeah like, yeah. yeah like that's well, like, that is the worst case that's actually the worst case moment. scenario and it still sounds like really fucking that's good. a that's win <laughs> yeah honestly <laughs> Because it's like, I, it's just, just like that, that whole thing where you used to be able to like go to a place and see like cool science stuff and people who like sort of just, just get it, right? Yeah. Like the, the 3D printing community is like, mm -hmm. is like this like pretty tight knit community. It, and it's like, like, have you ever had to explain 3D printing to like, like a mom or something? <laughs> oh, a hundred percent. As you realize and they're just like, like, so it, it prints the plastic how does it do that and i'm like oh it melts it it's like but they sometimes it just it just doesn't click and you try and yeah. you try to explain it in the simplest format possible but you know now imagine it's, six thousand people who all know already what 3d printing is and, and you, you don't have to, to yeah. heaven you don't have to start your video by saying this is a 3d printer it works <laughs> it works by 3d yeah, printing. Yeah. i i mean I think that uh, don't we have don't we have an exhibit that's gonna be that new the printer that like it folds? Oh, probably. Have you seen that one? I've I've heard well, of it. Yeah, yeah. I, I like think a I know foldable. It like yeah. packs down into the size of a a, a filament box. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, the portable Whoa. one. Yeah, so to speak. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like the idea is like it can it can kind of like become this thing that you can just shove in a backpack mm. and you can just take it with you to a, a maker fair or a convention or like I my, guess I think the funniest thing would be if like you your car broke down on the side of the road you have it in and you had a 3D print and you <laughs> oh, print whatever yeah. you print out a new tire or something <laughs> print out a, yeah. a new uh, you print yourself like a spare wheel just print a new car <laughs> yeah you print yourself entirely new you just you hoist the engine out the old one you yeah. put it in the 3D printed one scan it and then yeah. you, you just you, you take off that way. I assume is the user instead case. of a spare tire, it. it's just like a spare roll of filament. Mm. Do you think you could do that? Could you actually what? do that? Could you actually three D print a like a car wheel out of like TPU? I, or out something? of TP, TPU, I think it would just like collapse on itself. Oh. But if you like, if you made like a solid wheel with a TPU like outside like Ooh. rubber part, dual extrusion sort of a thing. May I mean like it couldn't be like a super heavy car. It'd have to be like. A, a motorcycle? A baby car? Can you a do a motorcycle? Car. Oh, a motorcycle! Yeah, yeah. motorcycle. Okay, <laughs> me and a friend were thinking about potentially trying that with a moped. So we might, we, we'll start small. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then we can work yeah. up to my 4,000 pound uh, town car. <laughs> and we'll see if it holds oh, there. <laughs> what, oh, no, I remember. Where, where was it where you were driving us around? Was it uh, was North it actually Carolina. Mr. North, Mr. Mr. The Beast. Mr. Beast thing? Yeah. yeah. So, like, I remember it, it, it's, it handled like a boat. Was, yeah. Who said yes. that? Yeah. I call it the boat mobile. The boat okay, mobile. because you, you can start steering and it's still gonna go straight for yeah, a while. Yeah. Oh, love that! Love that for a car. It's, yeah. it's got that inertia. In order yeah, to like brake, you have to push one. the pedal in like like a clutch almost. It yeah. goes like all the way. In. <laughs> <laughs> that really gonna be assertive. It's yes. it's the oldest, like the fact that you are what twenty. Three, four. four, 24, and you're mm -hmm. driving the car of someone who is four times older than you. Yeah, it, it's it's odd. You're an old I mean, soul, Emily. Yeah, no, I mean, I work. If I do this stuff from home, I work from home. Like, you why do up. I need a fancy car? <laughs> and guess what? When I do, I'm a tank. If some guy wants to pull out in front of me, his car is that's, toast. That's his problem. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, you know. The hood on that thing is like eight feet long. That's like a that that crumple, crumple zone, zone on that. Insane. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> you get hit it's... by a rocket in that thing. And exactly. <laughs> the only thing that sucks is that people think if it's like dark and they can't see the color of my car, they think I'm a cop because of the headlights. Oh, oh it's and like so... the same model that the cops used to use. Mm. Right. So if I'm behind someone, then they slow down a lot because they think oh. I'm Oh. And I'm like, oh, no. But if I'm like 
like going up behind someone, sometimes they'll be like, "Oh, I better get over because of the cop." And then I'm <laughs> oh, like, oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. that's so, a good life hack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretend to be the police. Pretend, yeah. Yes. <laughs> the biggest problem I'll is that just people get a drive sticker. safely. I'll get around. a roof rack. <laughs> It'll make it look even more convincing. Mm. Yeah, yeah. And are you gonna have like a like a booth or like a, what? What are your open sauce plans? My open sauce it? plans are the same as my plans for coming here. Oh, I'm you just plan <laughs> <guy>. <laughs> look Yo for no. the guy. Look for the Australian with a paper bag on his head. No, yeah, no, yeah. That's and cool. or a face on his head. We'll uh, see or a point. face, possibly. Yeah. Possibly a face if I get around to the face. What would the face look like so people can recognize you? <laughs> You didn't even I'm just, just ask him to, time. You just <laughs> ask him to do a reveal right now. No. Could you show us right it's now? You, Could you just like... I'm you, but taller and a beard. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> give, give people a moment to really let that savor in. So, I mean, have, have, have you been to like, like, you know, events or conventions? Do they have computer science conventions? Oh, right. Well, you could ask if they had computer science in Australia. <laughs> oh, yeah. Do, do, do they, they have, have computers in Australia? Yeah, yeah, I yeah. thought everything was just run with like big tarantulas on gerbil wheels or something. Yeah, well, that's most of it. But we do have some conventions. I believe. I've never been to a convention. Oh, you were going to say we do have some tarantulas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we have a couple. <laughs> they power uh, small things here and there, you know. Yeah, just, yeah, just yeah a, a couple stuff. of things. Yeah, but it's hard when it's is, all Is that just or... like, um? because I remember there was an event around LA. It was called SIGGRAPH. I went to one of those. And so that was was like the the like American big like computer science expo where people okay. would show off like like virtual reality stuff mm. and like new like hardware that could run like whatever like visual engines like video game engines. Bunch of nerds. Yeah, a yeah. bunch of nerds. <laughs> I, I couldn't imagine you being like at home at a at a regular kind of computer my science. My squad, my people. They have yeah. uh, GDC, which is like the game developer conference. Um, mm, that was okay. like a month ago. Um, and that was looks pretty cool. I didn't go. You didn't go? No, but, you but I got mad to. FOMO on Twitter when, when like, seeing pictures oh, of people going. Oh, like, okay, yeah, okay. <laughs> I want to go. So I'll probably go to that next year. Um, we can we can try and make open sauce more like GDC. What, what what do they have that we don't? What do you want? What do you want to open uh, sauce? I don't know. I don't know what really either of them has. All right. Well, we, we're gonna have churros then. <laughs> yeah. Among Us yeah, statues. Yeah, yeah. Does that does GDC do have, have churros? I actually don't know. I, I don't I, know. It feels like a rhetorical likely. question. I don't know, but we we. I don't really care either way. Committing that to the us having do you, churros. Do you need right fire now? to make churros? <laughs> Who are you asking? Me? Uh, What's the question? Why are you well, Why are you asking me? <laughs> well, because we Emily, can't have any food that has, that's made with fire. Oh, I'm pretty sure you could bake them. Mm. I think they can be baked. We okay. can figure out churros, surely. Surely. Yeah. Can you, just, way, I mean, can you extrude them just in a, like a constant extrusion? Maybe. Like the world's longest churro. Yeah, just yeah. like don't cut it anywhere. Yo. Just have like be yeah. cool. That's pretty cool. And then at the end of the thing we split it up and we can <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> coming to open sauce, the world's longest churro. I mean I think that's like that's uh, that's essentially just like like that's a, kind of just a 3D printer at that yeah, point, isn't well, it? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah but for churros. And we can do churro why, racing yeah. where people like line up and they gotta get through an entire like meter long churro. <laughs> and then the first one to do it wins like another churro. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't think, I think we thought about it a little bit and decided it was just a bad idea, but I still really like the, the, uh, the shit cat in real life where the idea oh, yeah with like a bb gun or yeah something. you have like like a mm. bb gun or like something that's on rails but the problem was we couldn't figure out any way for it to be on rails and still have like 180 degrees of freedom that wouldn't just let you turn around and just pop shots at like people with it yeah and you know that if it's possible they're gonna i guess you could put like walls around it <laughs> i think you would have to put, i mean it's gonna ricochet right the babies <laughs> That's that's gonna be our our um, ball pit, uh, the like the thing that everyone takes oh, yeah, a I think picture that's of. Break someone's back. Yeah, it's gonna be that. the thing that like that everyone takes the yeah. picture of to prove that it's a terrible event. It's gonna be the shit cat <laughs> in the corner. What if oh. it's just like a block of soft plaster and you give people like like a fork or a spoon or like a little pickaxe? Oh, what? so it's just fully fully manual. So it's yeah. that's just sculpture. That's yeah. sculpting. Well, what, what's shit that's, that's the reverse of three D printing. It's no, like, no, shit cat is no. You're talking about <laughs> making. The, the, you're, we're talking about the same thing. You're trying to talk about sculpting <laughs> no, with a gun. No, I've just had a, I just I had a no brain blast. I've had I'm a so realization confused. that shit cat is actually just the way that people sculpt like marble. <laughs> yeah, but like. But worse. Mm. I don't know why it took me but so long to the realize that. <laughs> uh, if you don't know what shit cat is, a while ago we were talking about like making possibly the worst and simplest 3D modeling software. It's literally just like a block 
and and a gun and you like shoot shoot the block apart it was like yeah, you, yeah you're shooting you're taking material off with bullets you can't put material back on yeah and then you there's one button and it says export and <laughs> and it prints it's it. actually just it's literally <laughs> just chiseling like marble yeah. i've just realized it's actually not a new thing at all it was actually invented thousands and thousands yeah. of years ago that's all they had back then. by cavemen was guns was yeah <laughs> except like, we're gonna add bb guns they, they get, like a hammer they didn't because even get Mark. like an export button it's just a hammer well so <laughs> primitive <laughs> Imagine that. I, it was a time before export buttons. I just, it's like, it's like, it. There's so much more than you could imagine. Like going to create an event like that. Yeah. I don't even know. I mean, Will is doing most of it. Like William oh, Osmond yeah. is like, is is knee neck deep, yeah. ears At deep. At this point, he's gone. He's completely. He's gone. We lost him. <laughs> one of the plastic straws to breathe right now. Yes. Yeah. That's where I, I I actually I have a feeling that At least it's probably, plastic and not paper. Yeah, yeah. If it was a paper straw, he'd be dead. <laughs> he might even film like an. Int- Sometimes he films introductions for these when he's like not in them. Like he like the. So I was like, I don't know. What? Maybe there was. He's not allowed to do those that. Oh, no, you oh, haven't, you haven't seen so those. Good. Some, sometimes he'll he'll film an introduction for, for this podcast, like an episode that um, that sometimes he's in it, sometimes he's not. But like he'll like you know do like a merch push, or he'll talk about open sauce. So oh. he might have even done that, but Will's oh, not no, here right okay. now because he's working on some open sauce stuff. Yeah, yeah. he's just stressed out like, his mind. Can't on open do sauce. yeah, I can't yeah. do anything else. And it's like it's like that is that's like even that it's like. Just, just enough to make this happen. Yeah. Uh, so uh, buy some tickets. So buy some tickets. Really, and thank you, Will. Really want to sell <laughs> these legend. tickets. I, I don't know. I'm excited. I'm excited too. I'm excited. Yeah, yeah. It'll be good. I think. I, Emily, do you have um, do you have any uh, a, a wish list for Mark Rober? If there was one thing wish that list. you could do with Mark Rober, <laughs> what oh, would gosh. you do? He's not gonna do Just it. But he's can, not gonna do it. But we <laughs> can complain when he doesn't. Mm. <laughs> I don't know. What the heck? What what would I? I don't know. It's like a video or just like, you know, skydiving. Just anything. I think, um, oh, I would challenge Mark to a push-up competition, but only if I could build a device to cheat at doing push-ups. Actually, that sounds pretty (laughs) cool. Wait, now that I've just said that. Video idea. Okay. Write that down. Write that down. Like, it's going to be a little weird because I'm going to be wearing like a big puffy hoodie. And I'll also, I'm going to be making like, er, 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 sound at the yes. point. But other than that, I don't think he's going to suspect. Sounds like a stepper motor. Yeah, he's like, <laughs> er, er, and I'm like doing them really like slow. Like, oh, Mark, do, do your slower. I'm doing slow push-ups. <laughs> I would do that. I would do that. That would be cool. I'd, I'd just like give him a hug. I think he needs a hug. Yeah. What really? If there's one thing you could do with Mark Rober, it'd be to give him a hug. I think so. Just give him a high five. The poor guy's know? been working his heart off. I think he just needs... That's he just true. needs to take That's a moment true, yeah. and be like, it's okay, Mark. You can stop fucking uploading stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you can relax. You can yeah, 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 yeah. blink twice so if you need yeah, help. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I then was, I never let him go. Well, cause I, was, I was literally, I was talking to uh, our manager because we're, we're at the same uh, the management company. The boy. He literally used you as an example as like a golden child. <laughs> he was like, Code Bullet has released three videos so far this year. One but, a month. Yeah. What a month. That's so not true. <laughs> it's that, so inaccurate. Is that, I, wait, have it. you not actually done that? Because that was really? him, him pushing me to like upload more often, was using you no, as an example. No, I've done two videos this year. <laughs> but wait, what is I've done more, I've done like what? half. January, February, March, it's April. April. Oh, so every two months. Every oh, two months. you're a piece of shit just no. like that. This is like me. We're all Whoa, every shit. two months? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Worst upload schedule ever. <laughs> Hey, every two months is like my best upload schedule I've ever had. Wow. wow. And you, you realize like earlier this year, I think it was like, there was like two weeks between two Mark Rober videos and he did the bed bug one and yeah. the, like the delivery one. Yeah. Hey, and, I hate Mark Rober. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can't say, we're pitching, he's in the event. And no, we he's love like Mark Rober. <laughs> and we're using him to like pitch this event to people. You can't say that you hate him. Mark we Rober love makes me hate Mark myself. Rober. Yeah, <laughs> Mark that's, Rober. that's true. You can Mark say Rober. That. <laughs> Mars Rover makes us hate ourselves more than we even thought we could. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was, I was already doing a lot. Mark yeah. Rober, just holding up a mirror and, and I'm having to look at myself. After <laughs> I look, look at, at my own upload schedule, compared to his. Yeah, yeah. 
I, do, I just like I what what do you think is the problem? What do you think would make you upload more? And tell us the secret, and then so I can steal the secret, and then also do it. Emily, what's your secret? I don't know. Secret? Yeah, what secret, do you, don't ask you, me because my YouTube you upload tell us schedule your is uh, secrets right now. It's uh, not too hot. The person oh, no, when, when was your last has upload? To oh, are we splitting audios now? Is that what we're doing? We do this a lot. Okay, cool. Oh gosh, I mean, what's uploaded like secret to uploading more? If you had something like that, or no, what? Maybe one. Oh, oh, money. 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 money doesn't matter because no, yeah. your TikTok, like it's not very right? much money. Yeah. Yeah. That's it was, you it's still hated would me hate recently, yourself not do but it. So it, I, it's got to be something else then, right? All that matters is that yeah, you can't do it. Yeah, I don't know what it is. That's true. It's not yeah, money. It's not like I'd like to move clout. more on not TikTok. It's not clout. It might be like peer pressure. It's like not peer pressure. I think if someone came to my house every day and judged me for not uploading a video, you're going to get 2,000 people in this video. Go enter into a suicide pact like all of us right now. And it gives you two million. And then it's more like you if we don't know. upload, so, by I need something sites, more say, like April. Then yeah. we all kill ourselves. You know, okay. All right. Yeah. So I think that's that. settled then, right? Yeah. 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 Agreed. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Very good. Suicide pact. Agreed. Suicide pact. Oh. Agreed. Oh. Agreed. Oh, yeah. Agreed. <laughs> Emily, you're not shaking my hand. Emily, what's wrong? Yeah, maybe for good reason. I don't <laughs> it's know. Nothing, Emily. Yeah, what's what's the matter here? Go, yeah, go on. Check. Yeah, yeah, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Well, I'm so gonna figure back. that so out. So, what are your next three videos gonna be? Next three. Oh gosh, I know. Three, holy shit. I think I'm, Wait, is it three? We have to do three? No, one oh. video by the end of this month, otherwise we kill ourselves. We all kill ourselves. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. And you already okay. shook April, us, so. April, April 30th, or we all oh, die. Oh dear, yeah. okay. I don't know. I want to do. Wait, we all die, die or just whoever right, doesn't right. upload dies? No, all of us. So you have. To oh, make everyone right. So I'll be killing. Also. I'll be killing me and you three, if I if I don't do it. Yes. And oh, you want to be the yes. you want to be the guy? Okay. Yeah. So I'll be next the guy. three videos, like, yeah. Emily. Next three. Yeah. Okay, on the spot. Uh, I want to do. <laughs> this is all on the spot. Yeah. You, I guess so. You, uh, who is it's it? You were Jonathan. Yeah. I was like, oh, so is there like an outline? Is there a script for that was you? Like, uh, like, what? No, what do you think no this script. is? No. You thought there was an outline. You've never for watched these? our podcast before, have you? <laughs> there was an outline for these. Do you think we would talk about the things we talk about? <laughs> yeah. We would never if we had a plan. No, the editor uh, would just cross that out, cross that out. Who do you think we are, Jabril? We're not put together. No. So yeah, next three That's videos all, okay. on the spot. Okay. Uh, I want to do. This is how Iron Man uses the bathroom. I know. I just said I don't want to do Iron. Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. But, yeah. We were talking about this earlier. We were talking about this earlier. I think it's a good segue into going from the Iron Man videos to not doing them. Mm. Oh, also, I, like, just I by think, doing more Iron Man videos. No. Well, okay. I think it's a good segue, like. Okay. Because it, it, it will involve other that. things. Because yeah. it's going to involve like me hacking it apart and doing something stupid to it. Yeah. You know, I, I think I, it could be fun. I would love if it was like some kind, you know, like how like in the first uh, Iron Man, he has like, before it was nanotech, where it's like yep. this complicated, oh, like yeah. you can see the rivets unfolding and like the panels opening. If it was like that, but like on your crotch of like, <laughs> <laughs> and this thing, it just opens up and like, like a pneumatic, like steam comes out, like the CO2 get like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like the mark and then the, that's how it opens up so you can pee yeah it's like the mark 5 helmet that everyone buys oh like oh, several moving panels oh, yeah. but it's like there <laughs> i'm gonna have to be really careful about how i make this video though <laughs> you know, yeah. i can't i can't style. demonstrate it i'd be like this is here's the mannequin wearing it and it happening but yeah I'm not, i can't wear it you will not see me put it on it'll just exist okay here's problem. what happens yes the Iron Man suit just collects it and squirts it back out on its own. What are we saying? It collects. Oh, oh so, the uh, so the, the Iron Man oh. suit just works as like an in between. So it, so it like, collects it and then the Iron Man suit itself, yo, but much more powerful. Cool. Oh, like a water jet cutter kind yeah. of thing. Yeah. Could you water jet cut with piss? There's no reason why you couldn't. Yeah, right? of course. Because it's it's just the it's the the, the grit, the sapphire, the ruby, whatever. The kidney stones. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, little That's bullets. Well, uh, if anyone from the Water Jet channel is watching no. this, we've got a hell of a pitch for you. Okay, but imagine you're at like a convention and this guy in an Iron Man suit walks up next to you at the urinal and it's just all you hear is like, servo motors. And then there's like there's a hole in, in the urinal. <laughs> You're on, on the outside of the building. You just see yeah, like a yeah. stream of water no. shoot out the brick. It's like when they sh do some shit at Dragon Ball Z. They like shoot like this energy ball and just like goes through the entire city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's like how, Superman's laser eyes. That's how Iron Man uses a toilet. Yes, mm. yes. <laughs> there we go. I think that's a good one. That's a good so, one. I think we're gonna do that, that's and one. then, and then, and then. 
going to pivot further away a little bit from it. But even I want to do. I want to take an Ender three, and I want to replace the uh, the aluminum extrusion with like twelve foot aluminum extrusion and make the world's tallest Ender three, and then print like an Ender man, like an Ender dragon, like like a the printer, like an Ender. Come on, Alan. So I want to like take a like Ender three thousand or something. Sure, over three thousand. I don't know, but we we want to. I want to like. That would make the you... longest or tallest world's. Yeah. Oh, so I would like, make the world's tallest printer. That would give you the so like worst the Z. Prints. Oh like yeah, the Z that's, that's, that's gonna be it. awful. Yeah. It's like it's all massive. the way up to the right. right. Yeah. But then the, oh, the print okay. bed is like two hundred millimeters wide. Right. So it's just really skinny and tall. And it's so like, skinny. It's, it's like shaking back and forth like it's an yeah. Well, we're gonna bolt it to my ceiling. I think. Oh. oh okay. And that's so cool. it might help that's a little smart. bit. But then we're gonna like. Someone told me that I should print a uh, Doug Dimmodome's hat oh, with it. Oh, that's good. <laughs> so, <laughs> what's a Doug Dimmodome? Of the Dimsdale Dimmodome. I have this question. Dim, uh, Dim, <laughs> Dugsdale Dimmodome? Dude, you're almost doing it. Keep going. Dim, 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 what Dim, the Dim, Dim, fuck Dim, are we talking Dim, about Dim, right Dim, now? Dim, 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 the, the, the remix. Yeah. The Doug's Dimmodome of the Dimsdale Dim, 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 I don't know that meme. Podcast Barely is the it's a solid <laughs> oh, oh, he's the, he's like the guy that wears the white suit and the, the tall. I hat. didn't have Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon growing up, and so he has a really tall hat. Is that the idea? Yeah, <laughs> I think yeah. that's the whole thing. I, I yeah. you How do you not know about box? this? It's not like, complicated. I don't know like these the things, here, Emily. Like the, the dude with the gigantic yeah. tall There's white like hat. Yeah. Oh, thank you, thank you. So that okay. That's a Dimmodome, Doug Dimmodome. Look at him. He's a homie. Look at that. I see. I see. I get it now. That that's really funny. Yes, thank you. Now yeah, I yeah, know yeah. what now what it's we're like talking Sanders about. It's like Colonel Sanders kind of character. Yeah. How heavy will that be? I don't know. Uh, I mean, if it's just PLA and we make it what like ten percent in Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like one, one shell, ten percent. If I say I use what like three spools or something, two. I mean, if it's just if it's yeah. I mean, it's it's not gonna be that bad. Great. Yeah, especially if it's like to the ceiling. That's not bad at all. Yeah. I mean, you just use like a well. If you use like a bigger nozzle, I guess it will use more at a time. It'll be a quicker print, but yeah. Use like a millimeter, or be like you and print. Oh, in like I, 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 will, I love to brag about this. Is like the stupidest brag in the world, but okay. having a uh, a Taz Six more extruder because they don't make them anymore. I had to buy it used off of eBay because it prints with a 0.9 millimeter layer height. Almost every Whoa, every layer is point almost four. a full millimeter. The yeah. resolution is garbage, but it'll make the <laughs> fastest the fucking point. garbage Ooh, in the world. That's, that's How big is right the now. nozzle? Is it one? Uh, or is it, I mean, it's got to be around 0.9, well, it, right? For I, to do 0.9 height. I have a 0.8 nozzle, and I printed a 0.4 layer height. So, oh, oh God, is it really big then? I don't actually know be. off the top of my head what it is. It's like a 0.4. One, like I mean, a, 0.4 is not that. It was a 0.8 yeah. nozzle at 0.4 layer height. That's I what, thought you were supposed to do like a ha like half of the size of the I think nozzle. it's because I print. Oh, no, I th I'm thinking of the layer width, I think. Oh, not the height. Not the yeah. height. Oh, okay. okay. Cool. So I don't know. I assume it's somewhere around 0.9. But it's it's like it the it's such a waste of material. It prints so heavy, and oh, really? like especially when you're doing supports because the support is a ton of material oh, too. Oh yeah. So That's it burns through material. The resolution is garbage. But guess what? If you just need a hunk of a hunk of something yeah. as fast as possible, mm. That's I what love you need the a 3D thing. I love for. the thing for that. And like, it's like none of the holes are actual circles. But guess what? That's what drill bits are for. <laughs> 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 that's fair. That's what a I heat, guess. That's what a soldering iron. Yeah. That's yes. <laughs> Everyone has their normal soldering iron that you solder things with, and yeah. you've got your your pl melting plastic soldering yes, iron that you don't yes. care about. You have you have the two, and they're separate. Um, you don't interchange the two. Never. No, when, right. Yeah. I, well, never I think do that. that's no. that's a mistake. I think that you learn very quickly early on when you use the same soldering iron for both. Yes. And like, you realize it like, doesn't work. Oh yeah. no. Yeah. It's, what happens? If you, I'm not big into soldering. The soldering <laughs> iron tip has to be clean. Okay. Otherwise, yeah. when you try and solder electronics with it, the heat transfer just gets really, really bad. The solder doesn't kind of stick. It doesn't wick to the tip properly. Right. Like yeah. if you heat it's up the metal, it, it oxidizes. Mm -hmm. And like metal, the solder won't stick to it anymore. And it like builds up this layer on top of the metal. Okay. The mm. 
you're considered like doing do you ever dabble in like hardware or are you just a ones and zeros kind of a guy not really and like especially after this trip i'm like very gracious that all i need is like a computer oh after like, watching like, us go through all the bullshit that <laughs> yeah, we yeah. To, like what did you see like william osmond's setup where he has like four houses and each of them are, like <laughs> filled for the development <laughs> shit. <laughs> right like i have one laptop and that's all i need i was to gonna say and that you were exaggerating but like? yeah like, how many icons do you have it's your... like legitimately four <laughs> <laughs> it is it's and like, then like a shipping you're telling me you don't, you, don't, stuff. you don't have four houses filled with, with, with computers. keyboards and, no. and mice and how many computers? monitors do you yeah have? <laughs> how many monitors yeah like two <laughs> I have a pretty normal setup. How many how many icons do you have on your desktop? Sorry? Icons on your desktop? Oh yeah, now we're talking. Yeah, I'm actually like in <laughs> computer organization. There we go. Oh, there yeah. we go. Okay. Are you it's one of those guys monster. that like you, you like to keep your desktop completely clean and you just type in whatever you need so you have like a nice clean wallpaper? Or do you just like no, you throw it I'm all just, on the desktop. It's a free for all. Okay, okay. <laughs> it's survival of the fittest on my <laughs> <Yes>. desktop background. <laughs> I would, lo I would love to see you try to do like maybe like a second channel video <laughs> where you like, uh, like try and make uh, like a thing. You know, I've thought thing. about doing it, doing something with robotics, maybe even like Lego robotics, just like something that's super basic. I've been saving space on this side of the couch this entire time in the hopes that this dog would sit here. Yes. There That's we go. Finally happened. I've had him by my feet. Look this is him. Primrose. This is, uh, are we allowed to say what her name is? Are you afraid of doxing your dog? We're doing a face re dog face reveal. Do dog it. Face hey, reveal. Prim, you got anything to say? Primrose, speak. Primrose, <laughs> speak. 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 She says, oh, yes! <laughs> Dog a few words. She's like, I want to do it so bad. <laughs> Rising up like a burp. She still hasn't learned that like sometimes she can only, like if she speaks when I tell her to, she doesn't get in trouble. Otherwise mm. she does get in trouble, but she's still kind of scared she's going to get in trouble. Uh, speak Aww. bad. What are you doing bad? Oh, sweet girl. Oh. So yeah, robots? <laughs> robots. Yes. Yeah, yeah, sorry. We got distracted. Um, yeah, maybe robots. I don't know. I've never done anything like that before, but that might be fun. I'd have to keep it like super basic, but I could, I've thought about giving it a go. I think it's it's there's something like I don't know. There's something special about having the thing like exist in your yeah hands. in the real world. Yeah. yeah, yeah. There's something nice about that. Like and not not to say it's like you know I've yeah, I what the fuck do you mean by that? Well, I'm, I'm, what I'm saying is you don't do <laughs> real things. So yeah, it's yeah. like you're they're not real. They're real, real to me. You're not like a real creator. You're like a real, yeah, it. yeah. You're not like an engineer. <laughs> You know, no, it's just that, like, because I've, I've done, like, you know, light coding and felt very satisfied afterwards. Like, it's mm. still problem solving, but, like, having the thing itself, like, there. Like, and, and moving and doing yeah. something instead of just it's, sitting there. Yeah, it's, it's something else. <laughs> Why I, don't you go I, touch I grass? <laughs> You're ready. Yeah, touch, yeah. touch grass. <laughs> touch grass from time to time. I can render grass, thank you. I don't need to touch. Yeah. Oh, my God. That's so true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I make my own grass. I, I make the grass. I have a full green grass. <laughs> <laughs> it's a conversation with God. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, it's like telling God to touch grass. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I made the grass. I am, I am the grass. Oh, hello, Prem. The closest thing I've got to like real world stuff is I've been doing like VR stuff, which is kind of like oh, real world yeah. when you, you create touch the grass world. In VR. It's like outside, but the, you know, the sun doesn't burn my skin. <laughs> That's that, you know, that was the exact feeling I got the first time I played uh, uh, Zelda Breath Among of the Wild. Among Us. Among Us. Among Us. Zelda Breath of the Among Wild. Us. Is it's that such it, a realistic experience. It, it was like, it was all the things that you want from being outside without having to actually be outside. True. Like, mm. like running around and like talking to the NPCs, killing and eating, shit. eating bugs, yeah. killing goblins, Good but goblins. you don't have to actually get sweaty, you don't actually No, get, you're just like, like actually doing this, you're just moving your yes, thumb slightly yes. forward. Yes, but you still like, it was still gorgeous. But your brain is tricked into thinking that you're doing actual exactly, work. Exactly, exactly. It's like the cookie clicker game. Oh my god. <laughs> no. So I didn't realize that the, the idle games? Yeah, I introduced yeah, uh, Alan to the world of idle games and he loved that shit, holy shit. I, I didn't 
didn't know that was. I mean, I had heard of that sort of thing before, but I didn't know it was like a whole genre. It's a whole game. ass genre. It's a very profitable genre because it's just like drugs. So, so it was. It was called Cookie drugs. Clicker, and it's just a big cookie, and you just you you get points, you get cookies for tapping yeah. the cookie, and you're able to like spend the cookies yeah. that you earn to make things to that make more cookies. You buy a grandma's lot tapping yeah. the cookie. <laughs> And so it's like it's like literally the part of your brain that like you you get pleasure from from making a video like a YouTube video that does well. Yeah. Where yeah. it's like you just see numbers go up. Yeah, yeah. Except <laughs> it's it's effortless and it's zero consequences, zero stakes. Mm. And it was like it was this short circuit of like I could sit there. Yeah. And like every yeah. circuit in my brain that's been designed over the last two million years <laughs> to like have me to reward me for going out and yeah. hunting and eating. Yeah. And it was, they were just being satisfied by me touching a cookie. Over That's and so over dangerous. Over. And there's like no risk. The numbers never go down. I it's became an entirely perfect. different person for like four hours. <laughs> yeah, you were gone. You were I out, you were out of the like room. Actually unreachable. I got, yeah, yeah. The, I got the circ, because every time you, you buy an auto clicker, because you can buy an auto clicker with cookies and it automatically clicks. <laughs> Here we go. Who's going to be the rest of the podcast? So you don't even yeah. have to tap the cookie anymore. <laughs> Every time you get one, it surrounds a cookie, and you can get a circle of them around the cookie, and then you can keep going. You can get a second circle. Second circle. The forbidden second, forbid second, second circle. circle. I probably a third circle, but then after mm. that, I uninstalled the game because I realized mm. it was doing really bad things to me. It yeah. Like, <laughs> after four hours, it was, it was like you downloaded the game. And I'm like, oh, he likes the game. Like, okay, like he really likes the game. And I thought you were kind of just like into it and you could stop at any time, Yeah, but you couldn't. We filmed an extra and we went to the dollar store and I couldn't play cookie game while we were filming. And I actually felt annoyed that I had to, that I was doing something in real life and that I wasn't touching the cookie. And we got in the car, and I was fantasizing about mm. driving back you to the just, Airbnb. You like, just speed ran an addiction. So I yeah, could you ran touch straight yes. in and bought like a temple, a cookie temple. Yeah, I, bought, yeah. I went back and I had accumulated enough cookies to buy a cookie temple. I didn't you even know what a, a, cook, a cookie. Temple. That's just you dangerous. Had, you had illegal child labor working in your cookie. I upgraded mind. to child labor. I did. Nice. Yeah, I did. It I is. Got it all is. The just upgrades. Cool. I mean, it was like within the span of half of a working day, I had I had uh, accrued over three hundred million cookies. And it was nothing. I know that was the worst. It was like it felt like I had done a lot. It felt it was yeah. every feeling of success of like I have I have over seventy five grandmas in my yeah blood. working in my I own have ten cookie factories. I have accrued over three hundred million cookies, and it's like it was just worthless, completely worthless. Yeah, and it, I it, I loved every second. Oh, man. <laughs> you're loving that shit. We talked about egg ink. It's the same thing. I've got like six sixty billion chickens. Oh, you got egg ink. Farm. Yeah. Do you still yeah. have it on your phone? Uh. I, I delete it. I only download it if I'm flying on a plane. Otherwise, I delete it. I do you replay? Do you delete your history? No, no. It saves your history. Oh, but that's it, dangerous. Oh, I can't. No. You have an impressive brain. I can't no. not download that. Have you played it? I've played. I've played all of this shit. Oh, I've lost like months yeah. of my life. If you want to know what I was doing with my yeah, life, no wonder you were gone for a year. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just, you got Legitimately, ten trillion that was part of it. It was clicker. rough. That one, Raid Shadow Legends, got me. Uh, no. <laughs> that did actually get me. All the classics. I will say that that did happen to me. I, it didn't happen to me with Raid, and they never paid me, by the way. So, Raid Shadow mm. Legends, uh, you sponsored one of my videos two years ago, and you never paid me. Am Fuck I you, Raid. That? <laughs> I, I'll say it. Oh, <laughs> yes, I'll yes, do it. I don't want your fucking go. sponsorship. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. we'll, it's fucking I, what, drugs what, for kids. Okay. It's you, bullshit. Slot what, machine. What did you do? Oh, uh, so um, did you breach something, or was it them? Uh, I'm gonna talk about that in about three years. I have a timer somewhere okay. where the statute of okay. limitations are not, and then oh, I'll okay. talk about it. But the the one game that I did do that I like, legitimately got stuck playing, it was um. It was a Star Trek game. <laughs> and I, oh my gosh. Like, I know it sounds weird, but like it it, sounds weird. they're all the same oh, game. They're all this. yeah, they're all designed with the same kind of like brain circuit hacking. Yeah, don't where it's like, This was a like, sponsorship, right? Yeah, and yeah. They made you play it to this level so you could show this level in your yeah, game. Yeah, so like like part of my brain, it was like it was actually just like procrastinating on the video because I was like, oh well, this is part oh, of the work. Yeah, yeah, yeah this feels like, oh, like work. I yeah, have yeah. To I'm get doing to research. Level five I'm so that so I can hard. get the footage and unlock the ship and yeah. include the footage and the thing and say that I played it. Um, and then it was like, you know, I hit level five and I was like, well, you know, I, I just need to get another. <laughs> I could get more footage. I should get more footage. And it was like I set up a camera on a tripod, like as as a wide shot to yeah. get me playing the game. 
And like it didn't occur to me until way later. I was like, I didn't actually have to be playing it in the wide shot. I could have just been pretending. Yeah, you didn't have phone. to. But I like legitimately fired. have like 30 minutes of footage <laughs> of me just on the couch just because I was like, I need this footage. I mean, just what are you going to do? I have to play the game to get the footage so I can have it I think that video. they would be really impressed if you made it past level five. I made it way past level five. Yeah, yeah, I made it way you. past level five. What but, level you make it to? Uh, um, well, so there's, there's different levels of like the different structures in your star base, but I I think one of them, I think I might have gotten into like 25, 26. Let's maybe. go. Yeah. Um, and at that point then, like, you know, the, the way that the things scale, it costs so many points or yeah. resources or whatever. And stuff oh, yeah. takes so much time. It, yeah, it's like, it's like you're progressing, but it's never actually getting easier. Yeah. yeah. yeah it's like, it, it takes the same amount of time to like, finish each level yeah but it feels like you're kind of doing it faster like the numbers are yeah. just going up faster yeah and i mean like i i was actually kind of a fan of um star trek um was it tng or wh which one's the one with the card i don't know which, which, yeah which star wars <laughs> episode had picard in yeah. oh yeah 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 but i i like that series and so it was like it was kind of a cool tie-in and yeah. i i think i lost like a week like a week, a week. To that game before yeah, I yeah. mustered up. That the, feels reasonable. Power to what was the it. moment that you were like, what the fuck? What am I doing? There's like always a moment where you're like, oh my <laughs> yeah. god, I, I, I've returned I to life. I've risen from the dead. I think it was like. And then you the, throw your phone away. The game itself, or like I, or a tracker on my phone, I forget exactly, but I did know the number of hours I put into it. Yeah. And at yeah. some point, I, I realized the number of hours in the game versus the number of hours I'd spent on the video. <laughs> We're starting to get dangerously close, so maybe it's past. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and yeah. I was like, "Oh, wait a sec!" Could have made another like, whole video. Yeah, like right now, I'm I'm not even a YouTuber right now. Right now, I'm a full time mobile game player. Mobile game whale. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but to some degree, that's what all gaming is like. Something like RuneScape right, 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 isn't right, that right. different? It's all numbers go up. It's all like yeah. fault, uh, fake like achievements. It's like game theory. I don't even know, but man, they. It's like some kind of psychological warfare. Yeah, game. yeah, right. Oh. And especially yeah. mobile games, they're all like really vicious yeah. for some reason. But they make like shit tons of money. They print money because they. Yes. Have you heard the stat that they make more money than all forms of uh, other forms of gaming combined? I believe it. I mean, what that makes fans? sense. I mean, like, like, like games people are like so PC games. games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Console all games. console games. Like people like, are surprised. Predatory. They like rely on microtransactions. They don't yeah. have to make a good game. Yeah. They have to make a game that like exploits your brain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can and make it, like it thousands out, it's really of dollars. Easy to do that. Yeah. It's just uh, what do they call it? The uh, the Skinner box. You ever hear of that experiment? No. It was I think it was the Is that one. The rat with the dopamine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, I think it, that was the one. That's the button. The button that we talked about. Well, oh, I it's think like it a was the skin. It, it was it was worse than that. It was a box where you put a rat in it and they surgically implanted a wire into the rat's head. Okay. So it's like just a simple electrical stimulation. Like literally there was a lever in the box mm. yeah. and when the rat hit the lever, a little voltage was applied directly <laughs> to the reward circuit of its brain. So it's like the purest fucking high. Yeah. Wow. You, like, oh, it, no. it, it's like, imagine like heroin two. Heroin two, only two way point oh. possibly imagine what this must have felt like to this little rat. Yeah, this yeah. little goblin creature. God, I wish that was me. Direct <laughs> stimulation to the reward center. And this rat would push this lever against. They they gave it the choice between food or the lever. It would hit the lever. They give it. Yeah. The, they would put. They electrified the floor and designed it so that there were two levers on either side of the box, and yeah. each one could only be hit after the other one was hit. So the rat would have to walk across electrified taser floor to hit <laughs> no the button, way. and if it wanted to hit it again, it would have to walk back across to the other side to hit the other button. Yeah. And it would do oh it gosh. every time until they starved to death. Yeah, yeah. It would <laughs> hit the button until they literally wasted away and died. And I that's what a that. mobile game is. And that is mobile yeah, gaming, wow. ladies and gentlemen. Accurate. Accurate. <laughs> that is your children. Because it's like, it shouldn't, that you can't have the button. The button is too easy because it's like the whole reason that that exists in your brain is so that you go out and, and you, you do like, anything. Even yeah, like you eating, go out and you sleeping. eat a berry. You, you ask a cave woman out on a date. You, you, you go um, <laughs> make a YouTube video. Make, make a, a YouTube, YouTube video, video for yeah, other Make a cave cavemen. YouTube video. And it's like, it's old. The cave it's, tube. The, it's so powerful because it's like, that's the drive and you sh you just should not circumvent it. No, I don't fuck with that. <clears throat> Otherwise, I don't think yeah. I'm going to play 
video games ever just, again. I know. Now, yeah, after yeah. this, the whole conversation, it's like, I'm never touching a controller. <laughs> yeah. There are or my phone ever games. again. Um, All, like, social video games, I think, are positive. Especially, like, over yeah, COVID. I think that got better. some people through it. Yeah. I um, feel like it's, it's if there was a social aspect to the Skinner box. Like Among Us. Like, like, <laughs> like a, like a rat co-op. Like, the rats both have to hit the lever. That's, yeah. that's probably yeah, a that's little cute. better somehow. Yeah, yeah. You have to, like, hit okay, each other's level. more, like, farming games where you have to, like, farm and, like, grind and stuff like that. Yeah, but like Mario Minecraft. Kart, Smash Brothers, yeah, Mine Minecraft. No, not Minecraft. Not Minecraft. No. Minecraft no. can be social. Like so, some forms of Minecraft are all right. Yeah, but if you're playing it like alone in a room, then yeah, you know, like a dark <laughs> at three a.m. <laughs> That's how I play. It. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's other ways to play. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The apparently. urge to play always comes in waves. You know, like you'll play for like yeah, like a week, and then it goes away, and then like five months later, you're like Minecraft. Minecraft. <laughs> like, it calls me. It calls me. <laughs> do you guys? Do you guys get that feeling that you know when you listen to the soundtrack? Do you ever? Do oh, you yeah. ever get that that feel that just what is it about that? Like the nostalgia yeah. feeling or whatever. Yeah, but how does that? I've never experienced it before. But when I hear it, it's, it's so cause nice. it's not. Yeah. It's not. It's like it's like it's like um um like I don't know some kind. It's like nostalgia too. <laughs> like it's it's so much more than regularness. Yeah. Something about that yeah. soundtrack in particular. I don't like, know what it is. It's like nostalgia. And calming and like it's reassuring. Yeah. It's something. It makes Gen Z it just makes them cry, right? That's like the meme, yeah. Like yeah. The TikToks. Where oh yeah, because like we didn't really like grow up with that. I didn't super much. grow up with it either. Yeah. yeah, I think I didn't actually touch Minecraft until I was like twenty. Yeah, maybe even like twenty-two. Yeah, actually. so I don't like have fond memories of playing it as like a young but kid. But even for me, it still is like damn. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's something yeah. about the it's music. Deep, it's so like man. calming <laughs> yet like. Ah, like it, re- it makes you really want to play it. Makes you want to yeah, because it's, it's twenty four and you're twenty six. Am I allowed to say you're twenty six? Yeah, yeah, I'm twenty six. So you guys were actually like high I only school? started playing it like two years ago. Oh, okay. Oh. I was in high school. I tell you, all the, the to that two year nostalgia hits. Yeah, me yeah, right. hits me hard. Oh my god, two oh, baby. years ago. Ooh. What a time it was two years ago. <laughs> <laughs> About when I had my hiatus, coincidentally. <laughs> well, I, I think that's yeah. still like, like that. That's like how powerful it is. Is like you can still, even from two years ago, like hear that soundtrack. Yeah, yeah, and it gets me, and I'm like, fuck, I should just go into a room and play Minecraft for a year. <laughs> I still like do it, and I'm like, no, don't. The opposite soundtrack is it's from Rust. If you've ever played Rust, oh I my god, no. it's the most anxiety-inducing. Like, if you just hear, if like. You could give somebody PTSD by just like playing that over a speaker at Walmart. They would probably just be like, "Uh oh." <laughs> I I haven't heard. What does it sound like? I don't know. It's what just it kind of like. like your typical like horror movie esque music. It's yeah, like, you just like unsettled the whole yeah, time. Yeah, just very unsettling and kind of like. Dun, dun. Yeah, yeah, and there's some like stuff in the corner. <laughs> exactly. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. It's like, Oh, oh there you go. Just unsettled. It worked. Oh, no. I activated the dog. Yeah, I'm yeah. sorry. Like, ah. Are you I'm sure sorry. you haven't played Rust? Because I think that you nailed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the vibe. I was, I was just trying to like work on a mod where it puts the Rust music inside of Minecraft. Oh, no. Oh, you're gonna, oh, really? you're I was about to say, don't ruin yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye-bye, Prim. Oh. oh. <laughs> My baby. <laughs> That's, that's, Prim doesn't like Minecraft. <laughs> that's a terrible experience. Like just crossing. It's all like a, a Clockwork Orange. You ever seen a Clockwork Orange? No. no. Where it's like the, I know, the. I know about it. Like I know. You know, like like the that like kind of the iconic infamous scene at the end where he's like, like trying to brainwash you. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. it's like his his like his eyes are like kept open with the machine. And they're like just flashing like pictures. Yeah, they're so uh... so they're like they're they're forcing him to. They're classically conditioning him to like essentially have a conscience. Okay. So so they're like like they're putting footage on a movie screen of like horrible terrible things happening but they're all sort of like crimes that this guy has committed. Mm-hmm. And the entire time they're injecting him with this with this like fictional drug that just makes him feel like deep despair and fear like the worst feeling imaginable while he's watching things happening that he like typically enjoys like you know beating Primrose. the shit out of people. Come here. Um, Come here, the dog's walking through the cords at the moment. Oh, oh yeah, don't hit the There's button. There's a lot of anxiety just, in the room. We just got all the cameras back on, dog. Yeah. <laughs> and so it's like basically like the unintended side effect that happens is that for whatever reason the movie when well, while it's playing they're also playing like classical music alongside it just just right. because. Yeah. And so the conditioning 
works not just for like the images but also for the music and so af after that whenever that character hears classical music he just flies into this, like this ptsd like like oh, he has, and at the yeah. end of the movie he jumps out a window because there's music playing that matches what he heard before oh, okay. and he just he has to jump out the window yeah, to get well. away from it. yeah so it's, it's, that's what you're trying to do. Like to the in the Zoolander. Here. Yeah, that's what, if you like could monitor somebody's <laughs> blood pressure and then like the music from Rust came on, it would be noticeably higher. The it's like, oh. would go up. <laughs> <laughs> A job and play rust. It's a life. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, a, it's lifestyle a lifestyle choice. Like, yeah, actually, playing rust. Yeah. And like, so I would, I would be in my base, but I would leave my computer on and the volume up, and like, I would hear oh, somebody. No. My no. Face up, and I would like run into my office and start. No. Again. Yeah. yeah. I'm, just, I'm like, I just want to complete a wipe and live. I just want to live. So I'm asking for. <laughs> I yeah, I know. I just want to make it to the end in the same base I started at. Yeah, yeah. I don't. Think I don't think I've ever done it. The only game I think I've I've maybe put that many hours in like like multiplayer is actually just like like Smash Brothers or Mario Kart. Oh really? Like I yeah. never really did like the the like the like the big online stuff. Mm. Um, I never even did like other fighting games. Maybe Fortnite. It's not not even Fortnite. I I mean like I I really like the any of the like like um like Smash Brothers oh. or Street Fighter generally because those people they're they're basically like modern day chess players. Shiloh yeah, there. they're too good. Oh, they're oh, we're getting okay, it all okay. tangled. There we go. Because it's like you don't, you don't. I don't. Maybe you don't think of it like that. Like with the, like if you're just button mashing, but like yeah. there's so much yeah. thought and strategy. At a higher level, it is. It's like mm. chess, but way faster and cooler because like it's yeah, way, yeah, you yeah can, you more can't, explosions than you chess. You can't falcon punch in chess. No, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I've texted the mods about that. Yeah. Chess. <laughs> there's no like eagle screech when They'll you patch it soon. I know. <laughs> oh my god. That you should make a chess board that has like sound effects. And yeah, yeah. When you just do all the smash characters. I feel like that's maybe like the real solution to like the uh the thing that Jabril's been working on the the, like the basketball thing oh yeah if it was just chess but it had smash brother move sets that the pieces would do yeah <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> it, it's like it's speed chess but of like with awesome characters yeah, and i yeah. always like i don't know you ever been just absolutely schooled just like had had the floor wipe with your asshole by someone that yeah. was just like a god yeah, it's chess, like they or literally it's like from anything oh just anything, anything. Okay. it's incredible when I you mean, realize yeah. how much better this person is yeah but i don't yeah. i don't know if it's something like smash it's like what I'm, you 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 haven't you haven't played someone really good at smash no i'm smash. saying it's like you okay you're better than me at smash but like, at what are, cost are you good no nah. <laughs> no, he's like, no, it's not <laughs> worth it to become. It's not. Oh, worth it's like it to a get huge time smash. commitment. It's like you should yeah. have like done something else with your life, maybe. Yeah. I don't know if I stand by that opinion, but. <laughs> well, I mean, it's like what, like, in, like if there's an anime character and they've become like the best in the world at something, but it's because they like gave up like some kind of like they made some kind of blood pact like with a sacrifice. demon or something. Yeah, it's like a yeah. deal with the devil almost. But yeah. They gave up their social life <laughs> to become yeah. a smash. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like it's like you don't you don't like yes. sort of like think about or care about that effort you in, in the moment you only care that you're just you're getting your shit wiped up I yeah i don't know it feels like it's got get a life energy if someone's like, right, right 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 <laughs> what what are uh what video game do you think you've put the most hours in oh, and do you know how much is it minecraft oh, it might actually it might be minecraft because mm. i mean i played it in high school with my brother and so like me and him would just sit on the weekends or over the summer and if like the summers i didn't have a job or something like there was a lot of Minecraft. Oh, right yeah. now, me and Jonathan, we've been getting into Rocket League. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I never so, got that because isn't nah, it just like it's it's soccer but with cars? Isn't that just kind what it of? Is? But yeah, like it's pretty fun. It you get like to the point where you like try to learn to like fly and dribble the ball in the air yeah. and stuff like that, and it's like once you like are almost there, you're like I have to keep trying until I get it, and it's like it's kind of yeah, hard see, to stop. I, I've seen people like I've seen the clips. And I've yeah. tried playing the game, and I'm like, whoa, no, 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 yeah. no. I will yeah. never be able to the do The clips this. are so cool. It, those, Some of them are the crazy. people that are, like, doing a bunch of those, like, air dribble stuff, like, I mean, yeah. they put in, like, thousands of hours. I know. Like, I could see hours. exactly how many hours it would have taken me to get to that point. And I'm like, no. No, it's not worth it. Yeah. Just, no. 
No. I, it's 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 a car that has a rocket, right? Yeah. But yeah. like, well, yeah. so what? What do you like? I, I guess I've I've never touched. I've never. Yeah, I mean, you can like, be like airborne and stuff, and, like, and you can you control it, you can... like where it's going, and then is, like, is it kind of like a fighting game, or is it more uh, like Mario it's like, Kart? It's, it's kind of it's pretty strategic. It's like soccer, but with a car. Like, <laughs> passing it to each other. I think it's that hard. I yeah. I don't even know how I would describe it. Almost even like a like a first person shooter and you're playing duos but with a ball that you have to get into a into a net yeah like this, it's high stakes is it kind of high like quidditch? High is stakes. it like muggle quidditch is that a thing that's close that's close yeah. we're getting warmer yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah okay i still don't really get it I, I mean, no because quidditch is like a fictional game so i that played a little example. quidditch in college i did try to play Excuse like me? two matches hey, yo. Of quidditch in college. you played two matches of quidditch in college you don't, you don't, you I don't know, know if there's a real no. that's a real thing there's i knew quidditch it was a real games. thing but i don't know if i ever fully knew how that worked it's like it's just it sounds lame as hell <laughs> it is it is but it's also like i yeah. mean it's it's uh, whatever can get nerds active i'm all for but, uh, but that's fair it's it's <laughs> So, I mean, I think the worst part of sure. it is one of the rules is that you do at all times have to keep a broomstick between your legs. Oh. Yeah. And this, that is like how you are in the game. And if you ever, if you, if it ever comes out, like you have fallen off the right. broomstick. Because that's and you it. never use the broomstick. Yet. Like there's no reason no, you why you need so a broomstick between your legs. So you only have like one legs. hand free at a time? Essentially, yeah. Although okay. I think there are moves that you can do where you just squeeze and that also works. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, and so it's they like, have great thighs. The rules Punch. are pretty much the same as in the books, except you can't fly. And the so balls no are crime, also no aren't magic. magic. So the balls you have to pick up and throw yourself. What about um, the golden snitch or whatever? The golden oh, snitch is the most impressive part. Okay. So I will say that like the reason I stopped playing Quidditch after two, two sessions was because I realized, because of the position I tried to go for was Seeker. Because that's like, okay, that's the yeah, cool yeah, one. That's, that's the Harry yeah. Potter one. Harry Potter did. So the Natural problem is, is in real life Quidditch, the golden snitch is just a person. It's just a dude. It's a guy. Right? Oh. And so I, I went to USC and well, then it, just, I mean, it just turned yeah, out. Like, is it a drone? <laughs> no. It, so it turned out that at USC, they had like what was probably like the, oh, Audrey is, Audrey is having a, a time with the dog right now. She's trying to uh, fend off the, fend off yeah, the try not to fend get the, the cameras base. turned off again. But, yeah, holding them back. So the college I went to had like, like an actual like nationally recognized uh, snitch, golden snitch, because like they do have like competitive tournaments that are nationwide, I guess. Oh, really? So this person yeah. was just a, a guy who was really good at parkour. And he okay. was the snitch. And so the That's rules the rules for the snitch are they can go wherever they want. As long as I think they're it's like they have to be back on the field within a time limit, but there's not even You like, can just leave. You, you can just leave. like get in a taxi. The snitch can leave well, because well, it leaves in Harry Potter. Yeah, it's kind of like, yeah. Yeah. And so yeah. I I was trying to be a seeker. The mm. the game starts. The golden snitch takes off, and he Legs literally, it. he was doing anime shit. I'd never seen this stuff in real life. He did the thing, you know in anime where it's like a character, like, they run so fast that when they stop running, like, they dig their heels in the ground, they like, slide forward. Like, yeah. He did that. Whoa. I watched him do that. Yeah. He slid, like, two feet because he was running so fast, and he stopped so fast. Yeah, yeah. Like, leaves a crater what? in the ground. It was insane. And so, like, I am a stu I am a seeker who has zero experience. You can't even Naruto run. The golden snitch, I can't even Naruto run. The yeah. The golden wow. snitch. The first thing he does is he runs over to the closest building and did some. I don't even remember what it was. Some crazy <laughs> like triple backflip back thing. He he ended up. He was on the ground. I ran towards him and then he was on the roof yeah. looking down at me. And I was like, uh, okay, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, yeah, I'm yeah. not gonna play this game anymore. <laughs> I, I'm supposed to because he's got um like like flag football things that you're supposed to grab. Oh, okay, okay, and okay, he's like looking out. down at me and I'm looking up at him with a fucking broomstick between my legs. <laughs> He's the only he's the only player that doesn't need have to do that. Oh, he doesn't and, have a broomstick. Well, because he's a snitch. Yeah, okay. Fair and enough. so I'm like, fucking snitch. All right, I'm not playing this game anymore. This is stupid. Like, <laughs> what's the what happens to that? Like, they can't win or lose, can they? They're like kind of time. outside of the game. Well, the the snitch is like like it's the same rules as Harry Potter. Where if you get the flag, the that the game ends and that team gets a hundred and whatever points or. Yeah, but so he only makes like a quick appearance every now and then. But like, yeah, but like, what's in it for him? He's just like running everywhere. Well, that's like... just one of the positions that he's. It's like a ref, basically. It, it's yeah. supposed to be a neutral thing. Oh, okay. Like, yeah, like the snitch okay. is always trying to not get caught. Yeah. 
Yeah. And so that's the, what's it to him is he has to return to the field every like 10 minutes or every, there's some time limit that he has to go out and be back by, but that's the only rule for the snitch. Yeah. What does he get off? Like he's not part of either team, right? Like he's just. Well, that's what I was saying. It's like, well, yeah. what's in it for this guy? Like, what does he <laughs> win? Like he just gets to run around on a field from a bunch of crazy people with brooms. And well, because, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it was a guy who got to show off his parkour every week. I guess okay. so. Yeah. It's okay. probably Cause the then, cause, like job. once he's on the roof, like he's not just standing there cause he does have to come back down every few minutes. Yeah. To like okay. check in So like the whole time He's kind of like up there And he's like He's doing tricks Like he's <laughs> just He's like he's doing He's doing like cartwheels <laughs> like yeah. And like yeah, He's, yeah. Like, and he's like, like flossing And like the whole time like Because the, the only chance I had Was mm-hmm. knowing he had to return mm-hmm. So it's like I'm just waiting down there And he's like taunting me And I'm like oh, Just come down here You've got to come emerging. You've got to come down And then of course Like when he comes down He yeah. does so in some Ridiculous ninja way That I have absolutely Zero chance of keeping up yeah, with Yeah yeah and he just comes out and he runs across the field and he just goes 10 stories up some other building. I don't know. <laughs> and that, that, that was, I, that's, that's why I never played Quidditch. That's why it's a fictional game. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why it's, it's a fictional game. And they should stay fictional game. This is a public services now, announcement to never play it, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure it's fun if you're into yeah. Harry Potter. It seems fun. I don't know. Well, so, because, like, some of those positions, like, uh, like there were some, like, actual big dudes on the team okay. because, like, the, what are you, the bludgers? bludgers, I think? Oh, yeah. yeah the yeah. bludgers are basically playing rugby. Yeah, okay. So, it's, like, this weird thing where it's, like, you've got somebody doing parkour. This you've got some people kind of running fun. after them. Part of the team, they're, like, you know, half of the team are just dudes extra? who are just hitting each other, basically. Yeah. And it's, like, rugby. <laughs> it's rugby. Do no, we can't. We would get creamed. No way. Are we making a team? No, the we people who play team. We just made a team. The entire let's story, go, I've been go. telling you how these people are amazing at this game and that you have no hope of playing against them. <laughs> You're going to start a team. That's the hardest position. Okay. We All got, right, we, well, blood, we, we need a seeker. Are we blood we'll, we'll, I'm big. We'll need a seeker. Yeah, I don't know any of them. It's not me. No, I tried. It's not me. I'm not. Mm. No, like the dogs I can't do that the sni- anime the, thing the right now. The golden snitch? Like, <laughs> it's an essential <laughs> part of it. <laughs> the snitch? The it's dog. like greased up crib. <laughs> you want to be a snitch? You want to be the golden snitch? <laughs> you get all the wings on her. It'd be so cute. <laughs> Did the snitch dress up in like a gold morph suit? They were just, it, they, their almost, uniform was just all yellow. We're almost at an hour. I know, I know. Okay. I saw. Listen, okay. we're just going to end it naturally. We're going to end it That's weird. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't yeah. know. I guess that feels right now. I think we, we made it to yeah, the end. Yeah, in conclusion, <laughs> maybe wanna, play it. You guys want to form a Quidditch team? Yeah, let's do Fine. it. Fine. Yeah. Jesus. All right. Safety, God. safety third. I definitely will. Even though I don't live team. in this country, I'll be there. Open sauce. You heard it here, folks. At yeah. open there's sauce. Gonna, no, there's not going to be Quidditch. <laughs> oh, my gosh. No, At open sauce. To one. We're going to the... release a greased up pig. On the <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're going to stress Will out and even more. And if you more, catch it, you get $10,000 from William Osmond. He'll give you a We promise. You a yeah. We can't fucking say that. If you catch it and remove it from the property, you get you get paid. Someone probably. is gonna think that's real. We can't do that. <laughs> well, we just have to not release a pig, and there'll be someone looking for a pig. Mark oh, Rober yeah. is the golden oh, snitch. Oh yeah, Mark Rober is the golden snitch. Yo, yo. His hat. He doesn't know he's playing though. So <laughs> no, please, no one. Actually, nobody mess with his hat. He will actually destroy all of us. <laughs> That hat is literally his horcrux. If anyone touches it, he might die. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He will end all of our careers instantly. <laughs> With no remorse. Would go buck wild on whoever touched that hat. <laughs> uh, I guess uh, we want to thank all our patrons and their names oh, yeah. are... Oh, look, Prim just squished one in my hand. She just oh. squished up oh. name. Like, oh. It's oh. wriggling. Oh, she ate oh. it. She oh, just God, she ate, ate the name. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah. Uh, uh, if if you wanna, uh, what are the things that they get? If, oh, the if, tiers. Yeah, well, the, yeah. The, yeah. Tiers, the five dollar tier is yeah. the. Uh... <laughs> Come on, guys, you uh, got this. <laughs> the, uh, the tier is on the screen in text it is on the screen right now. now. <laughs> Once you get it, five dollars. I know the fifteen dollar tier is the is the galaxy brain tier, and that's where yeah. You just get, get the, the fifteen dollar uh, ones. Get the other access ones. Access to the extras, and I. No, you get the extras and. And Polaroid every three months. <laughs> and you also get, like, so you get a discount on merch. <laughs> yeah, the discount on merch is actually, I've heard, like, mathematically pretty good, actually. What's the discount? Yeah. 
Um, it's, uh, it's uh, 15%? on the screen. It's right? pretty it's good. It's what it is. It's pretty good. It just <laughs> flew in on the screen. Whoa, on whoa. Magic flying carpet. <laughs> <laughs> so. So if you buy, if the shirt's $30 and you only have to pay 20 The duck going straight for the control board. Holy oh shit, my yeah. god, Just that was a line. Line. Yeah. Oh, oh no, 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 no.